Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to update your Retrobat on your Kinhank drive. So if I press enter here, you will see I'm on version 6.1.0. But if I scroll down and I go to updates and I check for start for update, or start update, it will not find an update for me. And I'm going to show you how to fix that in just a moment. Just want to show you here what's happening on a lot of people's Kinhank drives. Now, a bit of a disclaimer here. I cannot predict if it's going to mess your setup. I've heard from multiple people that their Kinhank drives were different. I've heard people decided to go in and buy these quote-unquote fixed drives, but they still have problems. So again, disclaimer when you're going to attempt this. So as you can see, no update available. What I'm going to do here, and I'm going to quit this. Oh, go down and quit. And I want you to open up your, uh, your hand drive and follow this file structure. So again, Go to Super Game HDD, Core Type R, Collections, then Computers, then open up the RAMs folder, and then the Retro Bat folder. I'm going to halt it here a second. I want you to download the link in the description, download the file, and you'll see it here. This is it on my desktop. Right click, copy, make this bigger for you, and we're going to paste it in the next folder. So open up Emulation Station, right click, Paste, replace. Just go back one folder, go down here to retrobat.exe, open that up. And now we're going to run the update and it should find version 6.0. Here it is. Press enter. Again, 6.1.0. So updates and downloads, start update. And it should find 6.4.0 as of this video. So as you can see, do you want to update? Yes. Preparing update, as you can see up the top, I can go back here and close down this menu and I'll just wait for it to update and we'll see what will happen. So as you can see, the update has happened. It literally took about five minutes for me. I don't know why. But as you can see, this says, please close emulation station now and restart Retrobat. So we're going to Alt F4 and we're going to open it back up and it should be on the latest version. Yeah, look, it's updating Retrobat. And we should be on version 6.4.0. Now, it does take quite some time to update. I've noticed this. I actually left the room, came back, sat down for a bit and just stared at the screen, then stared at my phone. It does take quite some time to update. I mean, it is cycling through a couple of updates, maybe. I don't know. Takes time to update, takes time to extract, etc. But here we are, we are back in Emulation Station. If I press enter, I'm on the latest version, 6.4.0. And that could fix your updating problem. Hope you enjoyed the video, and like always, have a lovely day. And thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you want to. Um, again, I appreciate everybody that does.